this virtual assistant thing sounds amazing, but there's one tiny problem. You think you don't have any experience and you don't know where to start. Good news, mama. By the end of this video, you're going to be clear on exactly what you need to do to get started. And the even better news is that you actually do have the experience you need and I can prove it. And make sure you stick around until the end of this video because I have a free resource for you that is going to make it super simple for you to start your freelancing business right away. Hey there, I'm Lauren Golden here with a new episode of Free Mama TV showing moms like you how to start and run a successful freelancing business from home subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified when I post a new episode of Free Mama TV right here each and every Tuesday. Let's start out by getting into the right headspace here, Mama. You've just heard about this whole virtual assistant world and you feel like you're behind. Everyone else knows so much more than you do. Guess what? All of those people were once where you are right now. No one is actually born knowing what a virtual assistant is. Everyone starts out with no experience. Your first day on the job, did you know how to do everything? How about the first time you became a mom? Did you have a clue? I sure as heck didn't. Seriously, right now, drop me a comment and tell me what happened the very first time you tried to do a diaper change. Cook a turkey, drive a car, or do anything you'd never done before. All right, now that we've established that you can do hard things and live to tell the tale, it's time to work on acceptance. You have to accept that Lean in close, make sure your kids aren't listening. You don't know everything. You're going to have to learn a few new things, but that's totally okay because as we've just established, you've been learning how to do new things for your entire life. The trick is not to focus on what you don't know or to compare yourself to people who are ahead of you. Instead, start with the fact that you're currently using a device that is connected to the internet, watching a video, you found your way here, that counts. You're a mom and you'd better believe that you have calendar management experience. How else would your kids get to the scouts, sports, school, and saxophone lessons on time every day? Who keeps track of all the kids' birthdays and their yearly well-child checkups? In online research, mama, please, you know the moment your subscribe and save price drops on Amazon, which grocery store has avocados on special, and when to book your family's vacation to avoid long lines and lock in great prices. You can do this. You have way more experience than you're giving yourself credit for. So now that you know I won't let you use the I don't have any experience as an excuse, maybe you're wondering just how to get started. Here's my question for you. How did you become a mom? How did your kid become a toddler or a kindergartner? How do we really become anything in life? You just have to do it. You have to declare to literally say out loud, I am a virtual assistant. Go ahead, say it with me. I am a virtual <laughs> assistant. Awesome. Now you have to get used to saying that in front of other people, which might feel really scary and intimidating, but it doesn't have to be. In fact, I'd love for you to commit to telling one person today that you are a virtual assistant. It could be anyone the woman sharing space in the waiting room at the pediatrician's office, your mom, best friend, husband, sister, just pick one person and tell them, I am a virtual assistant. That's step one right there. Next, you need to figure out what you'll do as a VA. And don't worry, at the end of this video, I'll tell you how you can get your hands on my monster list of 70 skills clients need your help with. Everything from managing email and booking appointments to uploading images to a website and tracking sales and spreadsheets. There are so many things business owners will pay you to do. And a lot of these tasks aren't difficult at all. They just take time, which is the one resource that business owners value above all others. When you step in and take over those tasks, you're giving people their time back and they will gladly pay you for it. So step two is for you to pick what you'll do for your clients. And then Step three is to take advantage of the many, many resources that are available to help you meet and connect with clients and other VAs. For example, have I mentioned that I host a Facebook group with over 25,000 talented women? Inside the group, you'll find loads of free trainings, plus you'll be able to connect with the people you need in your network. You'll meet with other VAs who are just a little further down the path than you are, which makes them the perfect people to model yourself on. 
You'll also meet plenty of potential clients and learn where else you can go and what else you can do to get yourself in front of even more people who are ready and willing to hire you as a freelance virtual assistant. Finally, if you're looking for a shortcut to get your skills up to speed, consider investing in yourself. You can find online courses that teach specific skills like funnel building or writing emails, plus all-in-one courses that help you start a virtual assistant business from scratch. I've put a few handy links below this video. So that's your to-do list, mama. You wanna be a virtual assistant and you don't think you have experience? Here's what to do. Number one, declare that you're a VA and start telling people that's what you do. Number two, pick a focus and grab my 70 skills checklist to help you out. The link is just below this video and it's totally free. Number three, get the support you need and build your network by joining my Facebook group. It's free and filled with mamas who are on the same journey to freedom and success. And we'd love to see you there. That link is in the comments below. And lastly, number four, when you're ready, invest in yourself with a course, training, or coach who can help you speed up the process and get results faster. And yep, you'll find those links below too. As always, if you liked this video, please let me know by liking it below, subscribe and share it with your fellow mamas and comment below with hashtag I am a free mama if you're ready to step up and declare yourself a virtual assistant. Hi. Okay. Okay. Every time I say, okay, I you know you're going to hold it against me. Whatever. Okay. Anyway. Okay. This is just not my best work. One moment, please. For you. That Jeez, why can I not say that? I've got a free resource for you. That, that is, <laughs> you have to accept that. Lean in close and make sure your kids aren't listening. Oh, you bet. And their yearly will check. And when the book, dang it, this is like hard for me to say. You start a virtual business. Nope. Finally, if, geez. Finally, if you're looking for a shortcut, can, Oh my good, good, good. If you liked this video, please let me know by, oh, got it, okay. Is, those are not words. Ugh.